what gangs do. And that's unfortunately a lot of what rap music does. And if you are a modern day John Lennon, you know, I mean, he might, he might have rapped too in this day and age. I don't know, but I know you're talented. And even if you choose to continue to rap, you need to try to use your influence to let kids know that that is not the way to go. Any social media platform, you are not to utilize any hand signs, terminology, or language that promotes any criminal street gang. You are not to participate in any criminal street gang activity. You are not to knowingly engage in any contact with any, any of the victims that are listed. Man, Young Thug would basically have to do country music. There is no way around it. That is it. You know, the judge was like, hey, man, you can't be throwing gang signs. You can't be talking about no street activities. You can't, like, he can't be out here talking about, I beat this case. You know, I got to work with it. He can't be doing nothing. He can't be doing no gang sign. That man came and scratched his head because he is walking on egg shells. Um, I don't, I don't, because it's, I don't know, man. The only way Young Tug can survive and still make music, because I know that's, you know, either don't make any music at all or start making country music or start making rock and roll music. I live in Nashville. I got a lot of connection. If you want to get with some people in the country music <laughs> field, get with me and trust me, I can hook you up with some real country stars. But, do Young Tug, hip hop and rap is done for you. Do not go back to hip hop and rap or you're going to go to prison because the judge is very strict. You can't be, and I'm going to play the clips, you can't be out here, you know, talking about anything gang related. And you know how those people are. You can say me and my homies, you know, in the car, you know, oh, you with some gang members. Oh, he can't even make music for just anybody. There's just a lot going on. Um, so, and the judge son him. The judge, I'm like, you sitting there watching him getting son by the judge. Hey, man, listen, I know. You got to be careful what you say. You got to be careful with your rap music, your lyrics, because a lot of people are influenced by it. And the judge was really tough on that. But, yeah. Look. If Young Thug make music and the rap, what is, what is he going to rap about? I don't see what else he could rap about. He can't do no gang signs. He can't be holding no gun. He can't have no gun in his videos. Or he's not even supposed to be with guns in real life. Uh, of course, no drugs. He can't be, he can't make music with other convict members. We saw that happen with my boy BG, uh, where he got in trouble because he was making music. Oh, allegedly, he made music with another convict. But yeah, dude, the only way Young Thug is going to survive out right here, music-wise, is to switch over to country. You know, talk about some girl breaking your heart, talk about love, talk about you know, any other things, but you cannot, there's nothing to talk about. There's no more, you know, I don't know, man, but you can't be talking about drugs. You can't be talking about guns. You can't be talking about, you know, doing whatever you doing with your ops. You can't be talking, obviously, man, don't talk about the case. May I just be, the, you know, you know how rappers be quick to be like, may I just be the case, you know, my, I beat a murder case or blah, 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 blah. You can't be out here talking like that. But, uh, yeah, I'm watching him getting sunned by the judge. And, you know, us men, we can learn from that. You know, a grown ass man stay in front of the judge. And she's just sunning him like, hey, be careful how you talk. You know, watch how you talk. You know, you probably be the, you know, uh, present day John Lennon or whatever. And you have a lot of influence. And all those kind of like, she's trying to compare his art to like wrestling where uh, it seems fake, but a lot of people think it's real. Like, whatever he's saying could be fake, but a lot of kids imitate it and go out here and do crimes and stuff. But now, nah, I'm going to tell you this, and you can mark my words. So, man, Pierre said this. If Young Tug make music again, he need to stay away from rap. He needs to stay away from... <laughs> yo, just stay away from black people, man. 
Um, because anybody, you know, you could be hanging out with Jamal and, you know, Jamal got a worker, you didn't even know. And, you know, it's like he's working on eggshells right now. Like he is on straight. The terms is so straight. And, um, dude, you got, you got to start making country music. That's the only thing I can tell you, buddy.